have you heard the latest rumors about the iPhone 16 Pro Max? If not, you're in for a real treat. There are already over a dozen exciting changes and upgrades reportedly in the works for Apple's next generation flagship smartphone. And today, we're going to dive into the 12 biggest rumors and changes expected for the upcoming iPhone 16 Pro Max. Even though the official launch is still months away, the rumor mill has been churning out all sorts of juicy details about Apple's next generation flagship smartphone. So let's get started, shall we? First up, we have larger displays. One of the biggest changes rumored for the iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max is that the displays are going to be significantly larger. According to display industry analyst Ross Young, the iPhone 16 Pro is expected to sport a 6.3-inch display, while the Pro Max will jump up to a massive 6.9-inch screen. That's a decent size increase over the current iPhone 15 Pro models, which feature 6.1-inch and 6.7-inch displays, respectively. The new taller aspect ratio should also provide a more immersive viewing experience, whether you're streaming your favorite shows, browsing the web, or playing the latest mobile games. New Capture Button Another big rumored change is the addition of an all-new Capture Button on the side of the iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max. This button is expected to be located just below the traditional power button, and it will provide pressure and swipe-based controls for quickly snapping photos or initiating video recording. The inclusion of this dedicated capture button is likely Apple's way of making it even easier to quickly grab those spur-of-the-moment shots or videos without having to fumble around the screen. Just press the button with a bit of force to snap a photo or slide your finger across it to start recording video. It should provide a more natural and intuitive camera experience, especially for those who tend to use their iPhone as their primary camera. 48 megapixel ultra wide camera. Moving on to the camera system, we're expecting some major upgrades here as well. Reliable Apple analyst Jeff Pugh has reported that the iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max will feature a new 48 megapixel ultra wide lens. This is a substantial jump up from the 12 megapixel ultra wide cameras on the current iPhone 15 models. The higher resolution 48 megapixel sensor should allow for significantly more detail capture, especially when shooting in the ultra wide 0.5 times mode. This will be great for squeezing more of a scene into the frame, like stunning landscapes or large group shots. The extra megapixels will also give you more flexibility for cropping and editing photos without losing quality. Wi-Fi 7 support. Another noteworthy upgrade on the horizon is support for the brand new Wi-Fi 7 standard. According to analyst Jeff Pugh, both the iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max will be equipped with Wi-Fi 7 radios, which is a major leap forward from the Wi-Fi 6E found in current iPhone models. So what makes Wi-Fi 7 such a big deal? Well, the main advantages are significantly faster speeds, lower latency, and more reliable connectivity. Wi-Fi 7 is expected to offer peak data transfer rates of over 40 gigabytes per second. That's a four times improvement over the already impressive Wi-Fi 6E. The new standard also enables simultaneous operation across the 2.4 gigahertz, 5 gigahertz, and 6 gigahertz wireless bands, further boosting speed and stability. A18 Pro Chip of course, no flagship iPhone would be complete without a brand new, top-of-the-line, custom Apple silicone chip. And for the iPhone 16 Pro models, that chip is expected to be the A18 Pro. Reports indicate that the A18 Pro will be manufactured using TSMC's second-generation 3-nanometer process, which is often referred to as N3E. This cutting-edge fabrication technique should allow for further improvements to the chip's performance and power efficiency compared to the current A17 Bionic found in the iPhone 15 series. We're anticipating significant boosts to CPU and GPU performance, as well as advancements in the neural engine for enhanced machine learning and AI capabilities. These upgrades will be crucial for powering the rumored generative AI features coming to iOS 18, which we'll dive into a bit later. Neural Engine Upgrades Speaking of AI and machine learning, another key rumored change for the iPhone 16 Pro lineup is an upgraded neural engine within the A18 Pro chip. 
According to the latest reports, this neural engine is expected to feature significantly more cores than the previous generation. The beefed-up neural engine will be crucial for powering the rumored generative AI capabilities coming to iOS 18. These AI-driven features could allow your iPhone to generate custom text, images, audio, and even video based on your prompts and commands. Think of it as having a highly intelligent digital assistant that can create content for you on the fly. Having a neural engine with substantially more cores should translate to faster, more accurate, and more versatile generative AI performance on the iPhone 16 Pro. It'll be able to process those complex AI models and algorithms much more efficiently, allowing for a truly seamless and responsive experience. Upgraded Microphones Another hardware enhancement rumored for the iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max is a significant upgrade to the onboard microphones. According to renowned Apple analyst Ming-Chi Kuo, these new mics will feature a higher signal-to-noise ratio and improved water resistance. The improved audio capture capabilities will be crucial for optimizing the generative AI features in iOS 18. By being able to hear your voice more clearly, even in noisy environments, the iPhone 16 Pro's AI assistant should be able to understand your commands and queries with greater accuracy. This will lead to a more natural, conversational interaction and better results. The water resistance upgrade is also an important practical improvement. It means you'll be able to use your iPhone 16 Pro for things like vlogging, voice memos, and video calls even in less than ideal conditions, without worrying about water or moisture interfering with the microphones. Improved Thermal Design Another hardware tweak rumored for the iPhone 16 Pro models is an improved thermal design for better heat dissipation. Similar to what we've seen in recent Apple Watch models, the battery in these new iPhones might feature a metal casing instead of the typical polymer design. This change should help the iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max better manage heat generated by the powerful A18 Pro chip, the advanced camera system, and other high-performance components. By more effectively dissipating that excess heat, the devices will be able to maintain peak performance for longer periods without throttling or overheating. 5G Advanced Connectivity Moving on to connectivity, the iPhone 16 Pro models are expected to feature Qualcomm's latest Snapdragon X75 modem, which supports the new 5G Advanced standard. This is essentially the next evolution of 5G, offering even faster speeds, lower latency, and more efficient power consumption compared to current 5G networks. The Snapdragon X75 modem is capable of delivering download speeds of up to 10 gigabytes per second, which is a significant jump over the 2 to 3 gigabytes per second speeds we see on today's 5G-enabled iPhones. Plus, the improved latency and power efficiency should result in a more seamless, reliable 5G experience, whether you're streaming high-quality video, cloud gaming, or simply browsing the web on the go. 5 times Optical Zoom for iPhone 16 Pro Another significant camera upgrade rumored for the iPhone 16 Pro, not just the Pro Max, is the expansion of the powerful Tetra Prism telephoto lens system with 5 times Optical Zoom. This feature was previously exclusive to the iPhone 15 Pro Max, but it's now expected to make its way to the regular iPhone 16 Pro as well. The 5 times optical zoom means you'll be able to get dramatically closer to your subjects without losing image quality, opening up all sorts of creative photographic possibilities. Pair this with the 48 megapixel ultra wide camera we discussed earlier, and you've got an incredibly versatile and capable triple lens system that can handle everything from wide angle landscapes to tight telephoto shots. It'll be like having a professional grade camera right in your pocket. Thinner bezels. As we mentioned earlier, one of the ways Apple is expected to increase the display sizes on the iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max is by further reducing the bezels around the screens. Reports indicate that these new models will feature even slimmer bezels compared to the current iPhone 15 series. Minimizing those display bezels not only makes for a more modern, edge-to-edge -edge aesthetic, but it also allows Apple to pack in more screen real estate without dramatically increasing the overall footprint of the devices. You'll get a larger, more immersive viewing experience without the phones becoming unwieldy to hold and use. Combined with the taller aspect ratios, 
These thinner bezels should create an even more seamless, uninterrupted display that really draws you into the content you're viewing. New Collar Options And finally, no iPhone launch would be complete without the introduction of some fresh new color options. While the specifics are still unclear, rumors suggest we can expect to see at least a few new hues for the iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max, including a sleek space black titanium finish. Of course, the classic fan favorite colors like graphite, silver, and product red will likely return as well, providing a familiar palette for those who prefer a more understated look. So there you have it, the 12 biggest rumored changes and upgrades expected for the iPhone 16 Pro Max. Of course, we'll have to wait for the official unveiling later this year to get all the final details, but based on the latest reports from industry analysts and insiders, it's clear Apple is pulling out all the stops to make the iPhone 16 Pro Max an absolute powerhouse of a smartphone.